All right, here's a quick video for our friends and family. We've got a bunch of frequently asked questions. We're going to go down the list real quick and try to do a little interview type thing and uh, answer some of the more commonly asked questions. Uh, first question is, uh, how big is our boat? Our boat is about 33.8 feet and 12 feet wide. So about how many square foot is that? It's probably about 350-ish square feet. Including all of the, the aft cabin to the beavers and give or take. Give or take, yeah. But the main point of it is is when you got a smaller area like this you make better use of your space. So we live in this space very much like we live in an apartment. Um gotta be uh gotta be smart with the way you put arrange your stuff, but we don't have any furniture. This is all you know, this is the way it comes. Next question is is where all have we been? We have been all through the Keys, from Key Largo to Key West, and we've the Dry also as well. We have also visited the Dry Tortugas, which is about 70 miles southwest of Key West. So we've been we've been here and there and all over the Keys. Favorite place so far? Our favorite place so far would probably be the Dry Tortugas, just for um, the snorkeling factor and all the great stuff there. Very nice uh, environmental destination. So not a lot of pollution, real clear, crystal clear water. And um, yeah, check out our sailing videos and stuff. It's our other videos on YouTube and uh, that's got some more of our adventures on it. Another question here is, um, is our boat big enough for us to live in? Our boat is definitely big enough. Um, we have both of us, two adults, and we also have a cat and it's just very comfortable and spacious and it is what it is it's a lot of boat and uh and it's ours we own it we don't have to pay any rent so that's definitely a bonus uh another good question here is do you get seasick and i say no no i don't get seasick some people do have the um the trouble with the motion of the ocean and whatnot, but it's to us it's like sleeping on a waterbed all day long. It's great. We did have an interesting experience with uh, when after we'd first bought the boat. When we came to shore, it felt really weird, but I don't think that's seasickness. That's land sick. <laughs> <laughs> Another good question here: uh, um, electricity. What do we do for electricity here? Electricity comes from the solar power. Um, we have a couple of solar panels that keep everything that we have going. We charge our phone on a 12 volt charger, which is the same as like, a car charger and such. Um, so solar panels and running their diesel motor keeps the batteries charged and yep. keeps us going. We've got a, a battery bank. It's uh, two big six volt batteries, like you would find in the golf carts, and uh, and that you that uh, provides power for our uh, you know water uh, pump and our bilge pump and our lights and uh, and all our other good stuff. Uh, we also have a power inverter too. So if we did want to run a blender or TV or whatever, we could do that. Uh, good question here is how do you shower? How do we shower? Well, um, we have a nice water pump that we installed ourselves, and we just have a, a hose with a spigot that has shower on it, and that's how we do it. Yep. You, go, you usually take a swim in the ocean first, get all get all cleaned up, and then rinse off and with soap and all of this essentials. So that's how we do it. Soap and running water. That's how we take showers. <laughs> okay. Uh, are you at a dock? Um, no. We are not at a dock. And why not? We don't. I mean, for the for the main essential of not paying rent anywhere, and also for the essential of having the uh, having neighbors on a dock can create many things, bring cockroaches and mice and rats and stuff yep. from other people, so 
And nobody likes that. Um, is it hard living on a sailboat? Um, sailing sometimes is hard. Just going, getting ready to sail is go is hard. But living on a sailboat, it's just like living on land, but better. I say it's hard, but it's fun, so it's worth it. Um, another good question here: Why live on a sailboat? And my answer is, why not live on a sailboat? <laughs> we don't pay rent. We got freedom. Uh, we can go sailing. That's a big one. Uh, well, being off grid. Basically, just the awesomeness of it. If you also, if you see any of our pictures and stuff like that, most of them are wonderful sunsets every night. <laughs> Can't beat that. It is really pretty out here, and you know, nice weather down here in the Keys. It's never cold. Uh, we don't have to run any kind of air conditioning. We could just, we keep our hatches open, and uh, the boat breathes, and it always points into the wind when we're at an anchor, so we don't have and to. And we run. also we also get nice, friendly acquaintances with the birds that come and hang out on our boat. We have a little friend. His name is Cheeto, <laughs> and uh, he just comes and checks to see if we've got any any crumbs laying around to clean up for yep. us and. And the last question here is sailing hard. Sailing is, um, I say it is what you make it, and for us, no. No, it's not hard. Um, the work, doing it, leading up to it, could be a little difficult at times, but, wait, I don't know, what else? The sailing itself is not very hard. You put the sails in the air, and then you point the boat where you want it to go, and uh, and then just try to make it go faster. Uh, it's fun. It's not hard. But uh, but like Amanda said, everything leading up to it and getting ready is uh, well. That's the the most challenging part is getting uh, getting the boat ship shape and fixing the stuff that breaks. And, uh, you know, that's the way we spend most of our time, is uh, working on the boat and making it better. And uh, I guess that's kind of like paying rent, but at least the money we spend is paying ourselves and not some landlord. So, say goodbye to the family. We'll pet this up on YouTube, so that way everybody's got a good idea of, uh, you know, what we do and how we do it. All right, much love, everybody. Have a great day. Have a great day.